Hello everyone. Today we will discuss about how we can do the on objective interaction power bi desktop September 2023 this has been released by Microsoft team. So let's get started how we can do that. In the right side corner you can go to the settings. To enable that on objective options we have to go to the preview feature. We know already every month the power bi Microsoft team release a new updates. So the new updates will be placed in the preview features. So now we are talking about the on objective interaction. If you look at this on objective interaction, you should toggle on it, then you should OK. Once you've done that, you will able to in the right side corner, you will see some toggles data and format and also performance analyzer. So there is a plus icon. This is a customizer pane switcher. This is called as a on objective where you can able to switch whatever you want to see in the pane level. So let's say example before you can see there is a pane option and you can able to pick the visualizations but there is no more option right now. If you want to pick any visual just in the canvas right click on that and you can get the add visual. Clicking this you will see one visual and based on that you can change the visualization whatever you want. Right. So this is a beautiful option which is released by Microsoft team. If you look at this, this is a 35 visualizations are available right now. There is a one more way you can do it. Uh, let's say we can close this option right now. So once you close this option, just canvas will be empty, right? So you can see right side of the paint switcher. You could, if you click that, see data is where you can get the data and you can format the data using this data and format paints. Let's say example, I don't want to see sync slicer and performance analyzer. If you look at this uh, particular pane, this will be disabled, right? If you cl close this and you can see only data and pane. If you want to look at this more visualizations into Power BI, there is an option called a visual gallery in the home tab itself. There is a se segregator for each and every bar charts and line charts and waterfall. And this is the latest feature on objective interaction will be too easy to interact with the different different visualizations in easy way right now this is a very beautiful option before there is an option in the pane in the right side that you will not get right now once you upgrade it to the september 2023 update and also there is a one more option if you look at that modeling option you can able to see some kind of manage roles in the security part this entirely changed it if you want to DAX switch editor you can change let's say example i want to create a, some roles based on something uh, user based roles right i can give the name and i can go and uh, click the some tables and create the switch right this, this is a very useful option which is coming from the microsoft and now security is a very easy piece to do in the power bi desktop level itself and this is a one of the beautiful option which we received in the september 2023 update i hope you enjoyed it thank you so much